is given ab is equal to 40 bc is equal to 50 ca is equal to 60 so we have to find out the value of a plus b plus c so how we can find out the value of a plus b plus c let's see solution first given is ab equal to 40 bc is equal to 50 and ca is equal to 60 right we have given this value so we can do if we are uh, uh, giving numbers so this is equation 1 this is equation 2 and this is equation 3 right so we have to multiply here equation 1 2 and 3 so multiply equation 1 2 3 then we will get AB times BC times CA, AB times BC times CA is equal to, now RHS, so here 40 times 50 times 60, right? Now, we can write this, A times A, so A square, B times B, so B square and C times C, so C square, so we can write this one, A square times B square times c square is equal to 4 5 is a 20 26 is a 120 right so here we can write this 120 and 1 2 3 0 1 2 3 0 now we got this value so here we can write this one a times b times c whole square because we know formula if m square n square is given so we can write that one is m n whole square so using this formula we can write this one abc whole square is equal to 120 triple zero now we have to remove this square because we have to find out the value of abc so taking square root square root on both sides then we will get here abc whole square and we are taking square root here is equal to square root of 120 triple zero now this square is cancelled from this square root so here a b c is equal to square root of 120 triple zero right now we have to find out the value of this number factor of this number so we are now taking factor of this number 120 and triple zero right so first we can write here 2, 2, 6, 12 and here 4, 0. So 1, 2, 3, 4. Now again 2, 3 is a 6, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4. Now again we can write from 2 because this is 13. So 2 times 15, 2 is a 13. So we can write here 2, 1, ja 2 and here 15 and here it will become 3 0 right now 2 7 ja 2 7 ja 14 and here it will become 5 0 0 now 2 times 2 3 ja 6 7 5 0 now here it will become from again we can write here 2 right so 2 1 ja 2 2 8 ja 16 uh, 2 1 2 2 8 just 16 and here 7 5 now it will become here uh, 5 so 5 3 is a 15 5 3 is a 15 7 and 5 now here again we can take 5 so 5 7 is a 35 and 5 uh, 5 is a 25 so 75 again here 5 we are taking so 5 1 just 5 and here it will become 15 15 5 is 75 now here uh, we can take 5 again so 5 3 is a 15 right 5 3 is a 15 5 3 is a 15 and here 3 1 is a 3 so we got here factor of 1 2 triple 0 this number so we can write this number here so, therefore we can say here abc is equal to now 2 1 2 3 4 5 6 6 times 2 so we can write this one 1 2 3 4 
फाइव एंड सिक्स टाइम्स टू राइट नाउ नेक्स्ट वन इज वन टू थ्री फोर फोर टाइम्स फाइव सो हियर इट विल बिकम वन टू थ्री एंड फोर टाइम्स फाइव एंड लास्ट वन इज थ्री सो हियर थ्री राइट नाउ ए बी सी इज इक्वल टू स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ नाउ वी कैन राइट दिस वन टू टू जा फोर फोर टू जा एट एंड हेयर इट विल बिकम सिक्सटी फोर वेन वी आर मल्टीप्लाइंग दिस नंबर सो वी कैन राइट हेयर सिक्सटी फोर टाइम्स नाउ फाइव फाइव जै ट्वेंटी फाइव 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 जै ट्वेंटी फाइव सो वी कैन राइट दिस वन ट्वेंटी फाइव स्क्वायर वी आर जस्ट डूइंग सिंप्लीफिकेशन हेयर ट्वेंटी फाइव एंड लेफ्ट टर्म दैट इज थ्री सो हेयर इट विल बिकम थ्री राइट नाउ ए बी सी इज इक्वल टू नाउ वी कैन राइट दिस वन सिक्सटी फोर स्क्वायर रूट स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ ट्वेंटी फाइव होल स्क्वायर एंड हेयर स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ थ्री नाउ ए बी सी इज इक्वल टू स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ सिक्सटी फोर इज एट एंड हेयर इट विल बिकम कैंसल स्क्वायर फ्रॉम स्क्वायर रूट सो इट विल बिकम हेयर ट्वेंटी फाइव स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ थ्री राइट वेन वी आर मल्टीप्लाइंग दिस टर्म सो ए बी सी इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी फाइव इट्स अ टू हंड्रेड 200 square root of 3. So this is the value of A, B, C. Now we have to find out the value of A, B, and C here, right? Now A, B, C is equal to 200 square root of 3. Now from equation one, value of A, B. Value of A, B is equal to 40, right? So we can substitute this value here. So we can write this one 40 C. A B value of A B is forty and C forty C is equal to two hundred square root of three. Now we have to cancel this forty so divide by forty. So forty C divided by forty is equal to two hundred square root of three divided by forty. Now this forty is cancelled from this forty so C is equal to now zero is cancelled from zero four five is a twenty. So five square root of three. This is the value of C, right? Now next equation. So from second equation B C, B C is equal to fifty. This is second equation. From second, now value of A B C is equal to two hundred square root of three. Now we have to substitute value of B C here. B C is fifty. So B C is fifty. So we can write here A times fifty is equal to 200 square root of 3 so 50a is equal to 200 square root of 3 now we have to divide by 50 because we have to cancel this uh, 50 so when we are dividing by 50 so 50a divided by 50 is equal to 200 square root of 3 divided by 50 this is cancel from this so a is equal to 0 is cancel from 0 5 for the 20 4 square root of 3 This is the value of a. Now, from equation third, c a is equal to sixty. C a is equal to sixty. Now, a b c is equal to two hundred square root of three. Now, c a value of c a is sixty. So we can write sixty b is equal to two hundred square root of three. Now, divide by sixty both sides. So we will get here sixty b divided by sixty is equal to Two hundred square root of three divided by sixty. When we are dividing this number, we will get here zero. Uh, this sixty is cancelled from this sixty, so b is equal to now zero is divided by zero here. So uh, now we can divide this number by three. So two three is a six, and here it will become ten. Two one is a two zero. So we can say value of b. Value of b is equal to ten square root of three divided by Three. This is the value of B here. So we got value of A B C. So we can say A B C is equal to A is four uh, square root of three, and uh, B is uh, we can say ten, ten square root of three divided by three, and value of uh, C is five square root of three. Now we have to add this value to find out the value of A plus B plus C. We can say a plus b plus c is equal to. Now value of a is four square root of three, so four square root of three plus value of b is ten square root of three divided by three plus value of c is five square root of three. Right? 
this is the value of c now we have to add this term so here we can say a plus b plus c is equal to we can take here lcm so we are taking lcm so 4 3 is a 12 square root of 3 plus 10 square root of 3 plus 3 5 is a 15 square root of 3 when we are adding this term we will get here a plus b plus c is equal to 12 plus 10 is 22 and here it will become 37 so we can write this one 37 square root of 3 divided by 3 this is the value of a plus b plus c in this equation and this is the solution thank you